Well, hey there, YouTube. So the other day when I made my video about voting Bionic Dance for President, I was only half joking. I honestly am not going to vote for Barack Obama again. Now, you know what? I fully admit he's done some good things. But he's also caved into corporations. He has not been nearly as much of a fighter as we honestly need in this country. And, well, just like most people in Washington, he's kind of paid off by the by some of the larger corporations. And I hate the idea that our country boils down to a lesser of two evils situation. Just like in the 04 election, it was either vote for Bush again or vote for John Kerry. Not that John, John Kerry was an establishment Democrat, um, and he was the lesser of two evils. Obviously Bush won. Anyway. A couple of years ago, when I was still living in Toledo, me and one of my gal pals hung out a couple of times, and this particular gal pal is very politically activated. She's actually, I don't know if she's dual majoring or what, um, but politics is part of her major. Poli -sci political science is part of her major, or at least one of her fields of study. And she brought up that if even a sig even if a chunk of the Democratic base leaves the Democratic Party, or at least does not vote Democrat in the next election, then that would really force the Dems to take a second look at progressive issues and possibly change. Because, well, let's face it, Guantanamo Bay is still open. Um, there are still American citizens being put into military tribunals and are not being Mirandized, are not being treated fairly. The Patriot Act still stands. Basically, the Constitution is being whittled away. And Barack Obama was supposed to bring change. Now, yes, I realize, it's his first four years, and there was a lot of stuff messed up under Bush. It took, him eight, took Bush eight years to mess up the country, and it's going to take a little bit more than four years to fix everything. But I am very tired of candidates who are drastically different than what they turn into when they're in office. I'm tired of a dual party system where it's a lesser of two evil situation. And so, I am honestly voting third party for all my candidates this time around, here in 2012. And I will be writing in vote Bionic Dance, because I have yet to find a candidate who's even jokingly running who is not establishment. I will not be participating in the dual party system. Also, as not party participating in the dual party system, here in Ohio, the, one of one of my old friends from college is actually running to be a senator from Ohio. Um, Richard C. Ebar, Ebar, I'm sorry, I'm sorry if I butchered your name, is also running for um, Senate this year, or running for Congress. And, you know what, I don't completely agree with all of his stances, but when it comes to issues that Ohioans are interested in, like labeling genetically modified foods, um, supporting, lo supporting local agriculture and the right to s buy and sell products, um, as well as he's, he has very good stances on civil rights, I'm fully in support of him. There are some policies that I don't particularly support. But I'm going to leave a link below to his website, and I highly encourage you all to check him out. Yeah, here's his card. Randomly met him on the street the other day, actually. He's a sweet guy. He's a very intelligent dude. Um, and, you know, as a third-party candidate, he's about as viable as, well, are there any other third-party candidates running in Ohio? I'm just saying, I will not support the dual party system. The United States, as much as the rest of the world, should not have to boil down to our politics being a lesser of two evil situation. It's bullshit. And the Founding Fathers themselves were fearing. They hated the idea of a dual party system. It's wrong. Multiple voices, multiple inputs. This is what we need. We're a country of diversity, from race to religion, 
to gender identities and sexual orientations. We are a nation of diversity, and we deserve to have politicians that represent us better. So, vote, vote third party. Peace out, YouTubes.